look at this quick. Now, this is something we call a sand pan. It's a raft. It's a developed raft. And you can see, we start out as a raft, and you can see we curve it, and you can see the development on it. We curve it, we curve it, you can see how it's curved, you can see how it's curved, and we curve the sides, and we, we make something we call a sand pan. Now the physics of aquatics, and we bring, we bring in the physics of aquatics. The ba basic three things that we look at when we build a boat, uh, we have to have buoyancy. Even in a submarine, we still have to have buoyancy. The next thing we have to have is stability. And the next thing we have to have is movement. Now we talked about these uh, university, <laughs> we talked about these university students and their movement when they're, you know, they're, they're, they're shuffling along and all this stuff. And we're saying this works, true, in a small lake, true, and, and may, maybe in a big lake, uh, you know, for a while, but uh, what's going on? We're exerting a lot of effort with with uh, with not enough forward movement. And as they're moving along like this, they're kind of bouncing. As they're moving along like this, they're kind of bouncing around. <laughs> Find the paper here. As they're moving along like this, as they move, what goes on is... A lot of energy is wasted in side movement. If I'm walking on a, 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 a soft mattress, mattress on the floor and I'm walking across it, or the mattress is in the bed and I'm standing up walking across the mattress in the bed, I can walk on it, but look how much effort it takes for balance. Look how much extra effort it takes to, to move. I have to pull my feet up higher and all this and all this. Yes, I can walk on a, a mattress on a bed, but it takes more effort. And in design, what we're trying to do is simplify, in most cases, simplify the activity or simplify the function to a point when I'm using less effort to, to go the same distance. I'm going from point A to point B, but I want to use the least amount of effort possible. And I want the best balance or stability that I can get. 